So here we have hoheri. It's really um, really good thing to notice the shape of the leaf. It's uh, similar to a, a tree called mako mako or wineberry, but when you look carefully, the edges are jagged in a different way, and that's that's actually a, a distinguishing feature. The other way you can tell hoheri is um, actually trying the plant, and as you can see, it's not the bright green and shiny like a poisonous plant, so you can actually try it right off the bat. And when you bite into hoheri leaf, it actually tastes like cucumber, and it's slippery. So that slipperiness has actually got a lot of what we call mucilage, and it heals all the mucous membranes in the body. So there's something straight away, you know, it's very physically soothing, energetically as well. Um, for those of you that know slippery elm bark, it's a medicine that's used all over the world. And basically, the slippery elm does a very similar thing as what hoheri does in terms of healing your mucous membranes. If you have a lot of either of them, they'll flush out your, your um, large intestine. Um, the thing about hoheri in New Zealand is there's quite a few species. I think it's up to five, around five different ones in New Zealand and I've seen three myself. Some of them have like a littler, more narrow leaf as well and so they grow on the South Island, they grow on the North Island, they're actually interspersed throughout the forest, throughout the bush in New Zealand and one thing that they have in common, you'll be able to tell from the flower, the flower looks like a star and the bark of this tree used to be used to make clothing, you know it's a weaving fabric. The tree's got a lot of going on in terms of healing your etheric field and I want you to tune into that and see what you can see or find or get a sense of. Um, if you've got this tree growing near you, it's really great if you can spend some actual time that way. Otherwise, um, use the drops, use a plant medicine and call the plant in. I'm sure she'll be there. And I'm um, wishing you a fantastic week and talk to you later.